Advanced open water course will start with you choosing five adventure dives. Now deep and navigation adventure dives are mandatory and we do advise you to pick the peak performance buoyancy dive. Other options are direct dive, search and recovery, fish identification and a night dive. There are more adventure dives but these are the most popular ones. The first dive our students did was peak performance buoyancy, where they got to do some exercises such as hovering upside down, swimming backwards, practicing 90 degree turns and other exercises that would help them control their buoyancy better. The second dive was navigation, where they got to practice how to use their compass. Also one of the exercises is practicing awareness and knowing where the boat is. During the dive, at any point, the instructor will ask the student where he thinks the boat is. And the student has to point the direction. This is just to improve your navigational skills. The third dive is a deep dive where you get to go to 30 meter depth. Our instructor Ethan brought his favorite bag of crisps to show how the color and pressure changes with depth. On the surface the bag is full of air and the color is bright red and at 30 meter depth the red color disappears and the crisps get squashed due to pressure. For dive, our students picked search and recovery, where you get to learn the three marine knots, how to safely use the lift bag, and practice some search patterns. For their last adventure dive, our students picked the most fun dive there is in the course, and that's a night dive. I'm James Code, I'm from Oxford in England. I've been here for a few days doing the Paddy Advanced Open Water course with Simple Life Divers. My favourite dive so far was the deep dive. The water looks so different and it feels so different down there and much better and different view of the aquatic life down there. My name is Varun, I'm from the UK and I'm doing my advanced open water. Probably the deep dive which we did earlier today went down to around 30 metres. Yeah, it was really fun. Yeah, I am a little bit. I'm very confident that my instructor will guide me and my buddy through it very well, but yeah, would be lying if I said I wasn't at least a little nervous. A little bit. I've never done one before, so it's quite new. It'd be weird not really having much visibility. Before the dive, you're gonna get a briefing on how to use the torch and how to communicate underwater during a night dive. The thing I do love about night dives is you get to see the fish that sleep during the day. On this dive, we saw some blue spot rays, different types of crabs, some nudibranchs, puffer fish, juvenile harlequin sweet lips, some fish sleeping, and other marine life. After you complete your five adventure dives, you will become an advanced open water diver you'll be certified to go down to 30 meter depth. It takes two days to complete the course and to start it you need to be at least open water level. If you're wondering how an open water diver course looks like, check out this video.